This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. He pops up for you guys, uh, May 25th, 1998. It's raw is war and John tent is back, but this time he's not earthquake. He's wearing a mask and calling himself Golga. And, uh, he's going to join the group, the oddities, of course, Golga, the character is a big fan of Cartman from South park, carries a toy of him to the ring. Chat me up. Uh, what did John think of this idea? This feels like this has Russo's fingerprints all over it. Well, yeah. Um, but actually the, you know, the funny thing is, is I met with Tenta and Vince and kind of made that meeting happen because John was, was looking for, for more. And he, at this point he was looking for work. He just wanted to come in and, and do whatever he was disillusioned with WCW and wanted to make it right. At the time coming in, we had this guy, Giant Silva, um, also Kurgan, who was a big guy. And Vince is like, hmm, we've done the earthquake. You've been these other names at WCW. And the only thing I ever remember him was like wearing some kind of shark paint on his face in WCW. So I don't remember much of what John did at WCW. But when he came back, this was like, cause I don't want to bring earthquake back. Maybe we could put him under a mask and, and do a deformity. So the mask was with a big lump on his head that you, you saw and went, who the hell is that? You might've thought it was earthquake because of the size and everything, but now what's this huge lump growing out of his head underneath that mask. Um, and the oddities were born. That was, that was it, man. What a weird, (laughs) I don't know, man. It's just, you think that shit in WCW with the dungeon of doom can't get any weirder. And and now we've got the oddities. This is just one weird. I hated, I hated, hated, hated the oddities. Um, but damn, if they didn't get a reaction, that crowd, they love to see, they love the entrance and they love the dance, the matches that bell rang. Yeah. But the entrance and the dancing, the audience loved. Yeah. I mean, listen, it's hard to argue that they weren't getting over. I mean, they definitely were, but that dungeon of doom stuff was so terrible. And I was such a big fan of what earthquake did with Hulk Hogan back in the day that I don't know, just made me sad. And then he pops up here under a mask. And by the way, it does look like he's dropped quite a few pounds here when he's doing Golga for y'all compared to when he was here as earthquake. Right. He definitely had. Yes. He came back and. Not so much earthquake shape being really big, but he, he looked good during this time. He probably dropped about 30, 40 pounds. We, um, we got to keep going here and talk about SummerSlam 98 because the oddities defeat Kai and Tai in a handicap match. And of course, Kai and Tai is Takamichi Noku, Men's Teow, Shofunaki and Dick to go. Uh, The oddities were defeated by the headbangers when the insane clown posse turned on them at the in your house, rock bottom pay-per-view, which happened in Tenta's hometown of Vancouver. And the oddities would lose to the headbangers at the 99 Royal rumble. Golga then finds himself in the Royal rumble match coming in number three, but he's quickly eliminated by Steve Austin. Fast forward a couple of months and John is released in April of 99. Had the Golga thing just, or the oddities thing just sort of ran its course and McMahon was tired of it and creative just didn't have anything for him. Or was there something else to this release? No, I think that the time had come. There just wasn't, wasn't a lot of equity in the oddities. And I don't know. There was a lot of longevity either. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.